So at least I've brought my waterproof enclosure for the camera and uh, my face, my snorkel face mask thingy. So I said, I said to Mal, just tell them, well, we'll go to the other resort. And uh, I bet we'd have got that straight away. They're not going to risk losing money, are they? Oi, be careful. Where's Ma going? She's going to have to go over there. She can't get that way. I think I'm going to just walk over there. <laughs> Do I? Just walk straight over. Do I? Do I? Right, watch, watch the food go in the water. <laughs> <laughs> Careful! We wouldn't want to lose any food. I will kill you if you throw that in the water. <laughs> Would you slide? <laughs> See, Filipinos never get phased. The water is cold. It's not cold. Yes. It's cold for you. What? Inside it's slippy. That's no good moaning, is it? Uh, who's cut his fringe? Have you seen the state of his hair? Who, who's done that? No, I did not do that. It's natural. Not demanding? It looks like somebody's had shears around it. Somebody has, that's been cut, you can see it's been cut. Has your mum been at it again? Well, it's been cut, somebody's cut it. I'm gonna have to have him to the, uh, the barber. He'll be straight in, Matthew, he's not bothered. Even if he fell in and his head went under, he'd just come up and spit the water out. Right, slowly, slowly. Woo! <laughs> there you go. Happy birthday to you. So it's, it's Kelly's birthday, the young lady in the uh, red, whatever she's got on. She's 11 today. God, when when I came here, she was like that. five, yeah, yeah like about so. like that, about five years old. She's nearly a young lady now. Yeah. That time flies, eh? When you're having fun. So as you can see, there's plenty of activity. The ladies always go into action and get everything sorted out. In the Philippines, that's just what happens. Uh, men don't do a lot, apart from sit, eat and drink. So look at that, look at... What's this called, Mel? What's that? Huh? And that one? Puto. 
and that one. Oh, it's just spaghetti, is it? Oh, you can't tell. It's covered in cheese and sausage. That's the usual. And we've got the cake. That's cake, Kelly. Let's have a look. Give my daughter there, look. But I've just found something and I want to show you. I'm not sure if you'd be interested, but I love this kind of thing. Let's just have a look at the other food. We've got some fish, we know. What's this, Mal? Pork stick. Pork stick. This is the chicken, the natural the, chicken. The chicken that you got scammed on. Yeah, my is dad, that, my yeah. dad scam, scam me guys. <laughs> Sweet rice, sticky rice, sticky yeah. rice. Well, it's close. Tilapia. Yeah, rice. and of course the rice. Tilapia. Yeah, yeah. What's this one? I don't know. What is it? Ah, it's talong. Ah, oh, talong. Oh. Yeah, I didn't have a clue what that was. I want to show you something I found. I mean, it's always been there. It was never lost, but you know what I mean. So come and have a look at this. See, I love this. You probably, yeah, what's the big deal, Chris? Because I've had a few uh, messages in the past when I first come here, and I'm in awe. Because how they do it, and they do it all by hand, and they work so hard. Filipinos are just so hard workers, you know? You've got to give them credit, you know, to feed the families. Look at this, guys. Look at this. Look at that. How beautiful is that? Right next to the resort. Now I was watching a, a video, but it wasn't in the Philippines. Uh, it was Thailand. And they were catching a uh, fish don't know what kind of fish they were I can't remember but they were catching fish they were putting um, like little traps in and they catch fish out of these I mean this looks as you can see it looks pretty recent can you imagine the work that's gone into this and the work that has to keep going into it to keep it you know manageable Here we go, we're doing the pictures, the selfies. There's the beautiful young lady who's 11, look. Look at that, she's gonna be a little stunning when she gets older. Huh? Oh, sorry. Sorry. There you go. Right. I'm taking video. So that other family has turned up, look, for that uh, place across the water. It's okay, we wouldn't have moved anyway, even if they hadn't. So, we'll go and have a look at the waterfall, I think. Because there's a couple of girls there that's been a little bit nash with the water. What's Nash mean, Chris? It means they're making a big deal out of the water being cold and... Oh, shit! Oh, <laughs> I don't think this is a good idea walking with the camera. Hold on, guys. <laughs> right, I nearly dropped the camera in the water. I'm going to try and get up a bit closer to the falls. Even though... Um, it's not really a big falls. I nearly went in, I was scared I was gonna, it's very slippy under here. It's like, it's just like smooth rock. Yeah, I know. My son's following me, look. He wants to go to the falls. <clears throat> Why is that not pushing in? 
There you go. <coughs> well, we did get here quite. Uh, <laughs> My God! I just went off the edge. It's good because there's gravel on the bottom now. I don't think I'm going to go. It's a good job he was here and I was holding on to that little ring he's got, otherwise I'd have gone in. So the girls are complaining that since the lockdown they've put a bit of weight on. <laughs> they said they're going to go to the gym. I don't think so. Uh, it's getting a little bit rocky there, I better stay here. I think I'll use Matt though to get back. Oh, it's great here. I'd, I'd love to do an overnight here, definitely. Would you like to do an overnight here, Matthew? Matthew, would you like to do an overnight? Yeah? He hasn't got a clue what I'm talking about. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm walking alone the streets are empty The only thing I can see is my own silhouette I'm getting stronger step by step is ticking but there's no time for me I've been flying from town to town